With WWE confirming the inclusion of the 40 years of WrestleMania mode, we want to take a look through each WrestleMania, include one possible match for each WrestleMania event. Now we do know that there's going to be 21 matches included in this showcase, so in this video we're going to be going through the matches that we think will be included. This will also include the matches we know will be included due to appearing in the trailer along with the matches that were teased on social media. Join us now as we look at all the showcase matches in WWE 2K24. Be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell. Number 1 WrestleMania 1 Andre the Giant vs Big John Studd now our journey begins at the very first Mania where Andre the Giant faced Big John Studd in a match that was truly a clash of the titans. The match was a body slam challenge with Big John Studd offering up to $15,000 if Andre could slam him. This match has been in 2K14's 30 years of Wrestlemania so it's a safe bet that if they're going to include a Wrestlemania 1 match then this one is the one to go for. Number 2 Wrestlemania 3 Hulk Hogan vs Andre the Giant which is confirmed. Who can forget the legendary WrestleMania 3 event with the unforgettable showdown between Hulk Hogan and Andre the Giant where Hogan famously body slammed Andre, a moment that has been replayed over and over again for nearly 40 years. This match has been included in both 2K14 and Legends of WrestleMania, but you can be expect to see it once again as the first 2K24 trailer pretty much confirmed the inclusion of the match. Number 3 WrestleMania 5 Randy Savage vs Hulk Hogan at WrestleMania 5, the Mega Powers exploded as Randy Savage faced Hulk Hogan. Now, this bout was not just a clash for the World Championship, but being the end to one of WWE's long-term storylines as the two men went from tag team to WrestleMania main event rivals over a one-year period. Like many in this list, this was also covered in 2K14. Number 4, WrestleMania 6, Hulk Hogan vs The Ultimate Warrior the ultimate challenge at WrestleMania 6 saw Hulk Hogan and the Ultimate Warrior collide in a champion vs champion match. Clash of WWE Titans was also another case of a new babyface world champion emerging in the Ultimate Warrior. It was also a rare case of an all-face matchup at WrestleMania. Now, this has been included in not only 2K14 and Legends of WrestleMania, but also in 2K15's Path of the Warrior DLC. So could it make a fourth appearance? Number 5 WrestleMania 10 Razor Ramon vs Shawn Michaels Highly likely and teased. The unforgettable ladder match at WrestleMania 10 between Razor Ramon and Shawn Michaels redefined what a wrestling ladder match could be. This high flying, high risk match set a new standard for the chaotic ladder match in ring action that we see to this day. Also, its inclusion in 2K14 plus a ladder match teased by 2K themselves makes it highly likely that we'll scale the ladders at WrestleMania 10 once again. Number 6 WrestleMania 12 Bret Hart vs Shawn Michaels the Iron Man match at WrestleMania 12 between Bret Hart and Shawn Michaels was a masterclass in endurance and skill. The grueling hour-long match displayed by sheer determination and technical prowess of both superstars. Now it was included in 2K14 but in a different kind of way. It wasn't a 60 minute match, however it's done with time skips. If included, we'll likely see time skips once again. Number 7 WrestleMania 13 Bret Hart vs Stone Cold Steve Austin confirmed. At WrestleMania 13, Hart and Stone Cold Steve Austin battled in a submission match that became an instant classic. This intense and gritty encounter marked the rise of Stone Cold's anti-hero persona, and although being included in previous games many times over, it's been confirmed through the reveal trailer that this match will be included. Number 8 WrestleMania 18 The Rock vs Hollywood Hulk Hogan WrestleMania 18's Icon vs Icon match pitted The Rock against Hollywood Hulk Hogan. This dream match bridged generations, captivating fans with a clash of two of the biggest personalities in wrestling history, Hogan from the 80s and The Rock from the 90s. It was truly one of WrestleMania's first dream matches and the match has been recreated in 2K14, but due to its significance, we can see him being featured once again. Number 9 WrestleMania 21 John Branshaw Layfield vs John Cena The rise of John Cena began at WrestleMania 21 when he captured the first WWE Championship from JBL. This match marked the true beginning of Cena's era as the face of WWE, and with the match being so important to the rise of Cena as the face of the WWE, we can definitely see this match making the cut. Number 10 WrestleMania 22 John Cena vs Triple H WrestleMania 22 was Cena's first main event and it was his first time going one on one with Triple H. It was a significant event in both WrestleMania history and the career of John Cena. The WrestleMania 22 arena was in 2K23 already, so we feel that 2K will get their value out by including at least one WrestleMania 22 matchup, and this one would be the best. Number 11, WrestleMania 25, Undertaker vs Shawn Michaels confirmed. Thanks to the trailer, we also know that the legendary match between The Undertaker and Shawn Michaels at WrestleMania 25 will be included in the showcase mode. 
Number 12, WrestleMania 28, Triple H vs The Undertaker. The end of the era match which took place inside Hell in a Cell would make sense for a bunch of reasons. One, they had the WrestleMania 28 arena ready to go due to its inclusion in 2K23. 2K24 will include the return of guest referee matches, so having Shawn Michaels as a guest referee in this match would be a great way to showcase a returning match type 2. Number 13, WrestleMania 29, The Rock vs John Cena. Last year, we got the first matchup in Cena Showcase, and it would make sense to get the sequel in 2K24. It also makes sense that if the Rock Hogan match from WrestleMania 18 makes the cut, as this was the next big dream match after Hogan and Rock. Number 14, WrestleMania 30, Brock Lesnar vs. Undertaker. The most shocking moment in WrestleMania history occurred at WrestleMania 30 when Brock Lesnar ended The Undertaker's undefeated streak. This match was an absolute stunner, leaving fans and the WWE Universe in disbelief. It has to be included. It's just too significant to leave it out. Number 15, WrestleMania 32, Roman Reigns vs Triple H. Roman Reigns' first main event world title win is likely something WWE would want to showcase, so we could see 2K include this matchup, even though it was far from a fan favorite when it happened. Number 16, WrestleMania 36, The Fiend vs John Cena, highly likely and teased. The cinematic Firefly Funhouse match at WrestleMania 36 between The Fiend and John Cena was a surreal and innovative presentation as a cinematic matchup. The match has been highly teased on social media and will likely be included. It'll be interesting to see how this gets handled in the mode. Number 18, WrestleMania 38, Cody Rhodes vs Seth Rollins. The big return of the American Nightmare took place at WrestleMania 38, and with the theme of 2K24 about being finishing the story, we could see the start of Cody's return to WWE story being told in this showcase. And number 19, 20, and 21, WrestleMania 39, Charlotte Flair vs Rhea Ripley, Asuka vs Bianca Belair, Roman Reigns vs Cody Rhodes, all being confirmed. And lastly, the next three matches have all been confirmed due to their appearances in the first trailer for 2K24, as in the trailer we could see Roman Reigns hitting a spear and celebrating with both titles. We could also see Rhea Ripley holding up the women's title after beating Charlotte Flair, and then Bianca Belair hitting a powerbomb on Asuka. It's interesting that 2K will be dedicating three matches to just one Mania, when there's so few matches compared to WWE 2K14's 30 Years of Mania mode. It would be better just to see one per event so we could get more arenas and matches showcased from older events. But we can understand their reasoning. WWE likely wants the current era to be showcased more than the past, and with WrestleMania 39 being such a big event for the new era of WWE, it does make sense why they did this. But there you have it folks, all the showcase matches for 2K24. Be sure to leave your comments down below on what match you'd want to see, and I'll see you next time with some more wrestling video game content.